My name is Zbyszek Kudzewicz. I'm a professor of Earth Sciences and a member of Polish Academy of Sciences from Poznań, Poland. I have been interested in different aspects of floods since the very beginning of my scientific career, including my PhD on flood routing. And then, after a dramatic flood in Poland of 1997, I developed even a stronger uh, interest. That's why I was very glad uh, to take the opportunity and participating as a consortium member in a, in a star flat project where I am responsible for one of the work packages. Well, Poland is a country in transition from a centrally uh, planned economy and a communist system to democracy and market. So it takes time to uh, uh, go from one system to another. We have done a lot of work and we have gone a lot of uh, long way. Uh, so now Polish system is much better than in the early days of democracy. That's why Polish response to the 2010 flood was much more efficient than uh, 1997 flood. There is a visible progress. But I wouldn't call it yet best practices to be disseminated to other countries. Well, the problem is that uh, the old legislation had to be replaced by a new one. So the first flood in 1997 happened exactly when the old legislation did not work already and the new legislation was not in place yet. Very bad time for flooding. Now we have passed many, many bills. We have changed our legislation uh, partly in order to fulfill the, uh, uh, the needs of a uh, of EU directives. Poland has been an EU member since 2004 and that's why we have to oblige to water framework directive and to floods directive. And this uh, creates needs to, uh, to, use, to uh, adapt our legal system. I think it's a good opportunity to learn from uh, best examples from other countries with a longer tradition of, of democracy and uh, more stable history. Polish, Polish history has been unfortunately very unstable with uh, lots of zigzag developments and changing governments in uh, 23 years of democracy. But fortunately, during the last election, there was a little continuity. So the governing party won again. And we consider this as a symbol of uh, a little stability. Well, so my criteria for success would be uh, multiple. On the one hand, if my country could benefit by uh, improving the govern flood governance, uh, flood risk governance system, by better adherence to a floods directive and my group and myself personally well we we are scientists so we are interested in in good quality publications that hopefully will be a product of of this project